So today, me and Phoebe are gonna go through one of the hybrid workouts. We warm up with the 250 meter row. Reason we do rowing is because it warms up your hips, warms up your lower body, warms up your upper back. And we're doing a upper workout today, so rowing is just ideal for stimulation, really, of the whole body. So we started by warming up with some overhead presses. Bar weight to start with. Always start with bar weight. Do not go into the gym and put plates on the bar before you've even kind of worked on your mobility, especially with overhead pressing. So I do a bit behind the, behind the neck, but I do a few in front and a few behind, and then I finally put some weight on the bar. But in this exercise, I'm trying to concentrate on squeezing the balls of my feet into the floor, squeezing my hamstrings, my glutes, then pressing up and over my head and coming under the bar. If you don't, you will have a massive arched back and it's not great for your lower back. Single arm overhead dumbbell press. This is for stability, obviously, because your core is going to be working like mad to counteract the kettlebell pulling you over. But it's also a great kind of isolation for your medial front and rear delt, really. I would always do kind of the leg I have at 90 degrees. You can do opposites, but I find it a bit uncomfortable. You twist the kettlebell on the way down, then you press straight up and over your head. Two or three sets you can do on this of eight to 12 reps on each arm. Again, it should be about 50%. I wouldn't do heavy, heavy because the idea is that you concentrate on your core. Here, this is a chest and tricep because it's a push exercise. But because I'm using one dumbbell, the body and the dumbbell, the, while, the weight of the dumbbell is trying to pull me off the bench. So I'm gonna to have to use all my stabilizer muscles. I'm gonna to have to use my quads. I'm gonna to have to use my hip flexors. I'm gonna to have to use all of my core muscles to keep me on that bench. So you're not only doing a push, you're also doing a core exercise. For somebody who like Phoebe, who is kind of got a better core, you can see she's a lot more comfortable on the bench. This is all new to me. So like you guys, if it's new to you, then don't worry that you don't look ideal because at the end of the day, you will look ideal very soon. So at the end of these, at the end of the single arm presses, I did a set of laterals straight into a set of verticals, three sets of eight on each shoulder. So verticals, laterals, verticals, laterals, verticals, laterals. Nice little burner at the end, but also you're standing up, so you're gonna be using all those muscles around your body. Pull-ups, they are essential. You should be doing pull-ups. If you can't do your pull-ups, try and gracefully, unlike Phoebe, get in the band to do assisted pull-ups. Start with the purple band, then go to a green, then go to an orange or a red, and then finally, you will be able to do pull-ups. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching, and I'll speak to you next time.